welcome to Coffee with Coastal Cheryl. Today, it's all about fall decor. And if I could tell you one piece of advice about fall decor and Christmas decor for that matter, it's never too early to buy it. It may be too early to put it up, yes, but if you see something you are in love with, buy it now, put it in a closet, and then you can decorate whenever you're ready. This is an example. Last year, this was like the favorite thing I bought last year. Look at this. Look at these little witch's boots. I mean, how cute. Look, there's a spider web on the back. I love these. It's a, actually a little vase. I put black tulips in it. It was so cute. I bought these in September and I shared them all over. I just, you know, was shouting it from the rooftops. Well, unfortunately, they sold out in September. So, all the rest of the season, all the way up until Halloween, I had people asking me for a link and I couldn't give them one because they sold out. And as of the date I'm recording this right now, these are still not in stock. That's the thing. Companies, they kind of, you know, guess how many of an item they're going to need and then that's what they put out. And once that goes out of stock, a lot of companies do not replace that for that season, if ever. So if you see something you love, Get it now if, because I check these every day. I sincerely check these every day. If these come back in stock, you will see the link for it on this YouTube because I will come back here and I will add it. But for now, let's hide them. I mean, aren't they, I just love this. Out of stock. Has been since last September. All right, let's get started though. All right, first of all, <laughs> I'm going to start with, oddly enough, my nail polish. It's so funny because I concentrate on home decor, but I get tons of questions on YouTube asking two things. What nail polish am I wearing and what lipstick am I wearing? So I am actually linking both of those. Boom, OPI nail polish, that's right there, first link. Everything, by the way, is going to be linked in order that I'm showing it. So that's the first thing that you're going to see. The second thing is my Maybelline lip gloss. So let's get on to the fun stuff. All right. First of all, honey, can you pull up the video of the white trees? This was the very first spot I decorated in my house this year. And uh, the first thing you probably notice is the three piece wall decor. I have included that even though obviously it's not fall decor. It's one of my favorite pieces, very versatile. And I think it, it, it does work great for fall decor because it's textured, it's woven. It kind of reminds you of a basket. It's got that kind of natural vibe, which always works great for fall decor. But the other thing, look at these trees, these trees right there, they are from a light share and you can get them in three different sizes, four foot, six foot and eight foot. Can you just pause that right on there? Thank you, honey. You can get that four foot, a six foot and eight foot. I have the four foot up on the cabinet on the right side. The six foot is on the floor next to the four foot. And in the other corner at the end of the cabinet is the eight foot. Again, you can buy these individually, all three sizes, or you can buy them as a set. When you click on the link, you'll see that will be the set, which is what I have, but all the other options are available right there. I love these. They uh, plug in. They are just gorgeous. You should see these at night. I mean, this is during the day, how pretty these are, but the limbs are all completely bendable. So you can, you know, make whatever kind of a look you want. If you want them to be, you know, curlier than that or straighter than that, it's up to you. Love these for, Christmas and fall. As soon as I start decorating for Christmas de decor, seriously, all I'm going to do is take those pumpkins down and start decorating for Christmas because I absolutely love these. It's one of my most popular things I share during the holidays. Everyone loves these trees. I've had uh, several of my followers telling me that they actually use these for Christmas trees instead of putting up a traditional Christmas tree. And let me tell you, it would be a lot easier. All right, next, right in the center, see the centerpiece is actually a vase, and then those lit branches, also birch branches, well, you know, not real birch branches, but they look like birch branches, and that's a three-piece set. All I did was drop them right down into that vase. I also have the vase linked. 
Um, they actually went a little too far down in that particular vase. I wanted them a little higher. So all I did was um, literally wadded up a dish towel and dropped it into that vase. And then they were exactly the height that I wanted them to be. But again, I have also connected, or I'm sorry, I've also linked the vase. It'll be right there. Now, next you see the pumpkins. I have two sets of pumpkins. The set on the left, there's more pumpkins, and the set on the right, fewer, obviously. And I didn't want it to be completely matching, which is why I did that that way. The set on the left is Dome Star, and that one comes with more pumpkins. It's 14 pieces. Dome Star, 14 pieces. The one on the right is Deer House, and that comes with eight pumpkins and you actually also get two pine cones with that one which is a, a nice bonus but i love the quality these are both foam pumpkins you know non, you know just you can't break it i mean just you know almost non-destructible but love those i love this the simple neutral look and then in the center i have got those three gold pumpkins those are glass and they each have a glitter stem. They are absolutely gorgeous. And again, that's a set of three and they have little fairy lights in them. Thank you, honey. Let me go ahead and just show them the pumpkins now. All right, here is what the foam pumpkins look. Both of the dome house and the deer, pump, deer house pumpkins are really very similar. I mean, they look almost just alike. It just depends on how many pieces you want. This is the largest pumpkin in both of the sets. But again, very lightweight, foam, great if you're decorating with kids, for example, because you don't have to worry about them breaking anything. I love these. I use these year after year. One of my favorite things to decorate because they're so easy and so affordable. So both of these, this is the Deer House and the Dome, Deer House and Dome House pumpkins. Yeah, both of these. And this one here, this is a three piece. These are gorgeous more fragile these are glass look at the stem can you see that it has a glitter stem inside fairy lights it's a set of three you can turn them on or off and you can also set them for a timer so they will go on and off automatically which is really convenient but you guys look at this if you're looking to glam it up a little bit this year this is just an absolutely perfect choice i lo love the gold now, if you still want to do fairy light pumpkins and you want to be a little more traditional, consider this next set. Honey, could you pull up the three orange pumpkins? Now, this is how I use this set in my house. I put them on a cabinet in front of a mirror. I actually do have that mirror linked also, but I love this little set. It's a set of three, and these are all uh, really nice size pumpkins they have the little fairy lights in them again like the other pumpkins you can turn them on or off or set them to timers so they'll be automatic just a beautiful little set of pumpkins thank you honey and this is what they look like i mean look how pretty these are you guys even when they're not lit i mean i love this kind of a burnt orange color so so pretty the quality is just gorgeous they've got kind of like a crackled finish so pretty i love this set so again if you're looking for orange and you want glass pumpkins i mean i don't see how you can get any better than that set and then the next thing i will link is that mirror that i just showed you it is from amazon actually all of these are from amazon these are all amazon finds which means they're affordable and if you don't like them you can send them back and get an easy return i love that free shipping fast shipping what's not to love but love all of these all right next again the brown mirror i have that link just show that real quickly again the three orange pumpkins there's the mirror Again, I don't even mount on a wall. I just put it on top of a cabinet, lean it back against there. That way I can easily switch it out, change the look anytime I want to. Really convenient and just a really, really pretty mirror. Honey, can we pull up the bearded gnome? Look at this guy. 
I get all of these pieces I will be showing you. There's the little bearded gnome right there. How adorable is he? I'm not like a huge gnome fan per se, but he is so cute and he's surrounded by fabric pumpkins and then I've got a rustic vase with dried grass in the back, but I love this look. Now let me show you each of these individually. Okay, thank you, honey. Here's the gnome, look at him. And look, his little arms, you can move them. They have a wire in them, so he could be like waving high to you. And then his hat, same thing. It could be standing up, it could be in a curly cue, <laughs> it could be bent over. I just think he's so cute. Look, he's got a little fuzzy beard. And then he's got, you can see like a little Sherpa coat on. Just again, I'm not a huge gnome fan, but these ones for the holidays are so cute. Look at him. He could have both arms up and be giving you a hug. <laughs> it's just so cute. All right, there's the gnome. And here are the fabric pumpkins that I just showed with him. Love these. If you are looking for neutral decor, these are a great choice. I just got these this year. If you click on the link, you'll see they do come in different colors. This one's my favorite though. Look at that. Can you see the pleats in it? All they did was take like a regular um, foam pumpkin and then covered it with fabric. But I love that look. Isn't that cute? Now here's the whole set. Again, if you're wanting uh, neutral decor, perfect. I mean, I love this set of pumpkins. Again, I would buy early because stuff does sell out. I've learned that lesson the hard way. So buy early. That doesn't mean you have to decorate early, but buy early if you're looking for any kind, whenever you're looking for seasonal decor, spring decor, fall decor, Christmas, buy early. Don't take the chance. All right, next, this cute vase set. Well, it's not a set. It's a single vase little rustic vase it says uh, flowers and garden on it I had this one for some time I use it all year long but when I got this grass which I did just buy this year I knew I wanted it in this vase I think it is a perfect combination there are 86 pieces of dried grass these are all real grass when you open it up there'll be instructions it tells you to take them out shake them out uh, you know outside and then put hairspray on them afterward. I didn't do any of that I literally opened the box and dropped them in I didn't even arrange them because I wanted to show you If you don't do that because you know a lot of times you see stuff and then if you're not like a wizard at Arranging flowers you get it and it looks crummy <laughs> It's like you can't figure it out now you guys I think this is really pretty dropped in here just like this now if you wanted to fuss with it, I would probably take these, these pieces here and maybe spread them out a little more, but I think it looks great just like this. This is the prettiest dried grass combination I've ever seen. I mean, I love this, perfect for fall, just so beautiful. I mean, look at those soft colors. It's such a pretty find. All right, next, can you show the uh, Gnome Trio photo, honey? All right, next, look at these little gnomes. These are ceramic, and these are so cute. I love the subtle colors. They're not like real bright, and each one is individual, and you can see those same fabric pumpkins I just showed you. Those are right there. So again, check out the fabric pumpkin link. But look at that, that you get the entire set, and <laughs> I love them. They're each posed a different way. They're each holding something different. And you also see I have combined it with a tabletop cloth, which I will be showing you, and a vase with um, some orange eucalyptus stems. I like combining my fall decor with my regular home decor. I think it is much more effective and a, just a much prettier way to show your seasonal decor. Thank you, honey. Here are the gnomes. There's three in a set. Look. And they each, I mean, they're really nice quality, really cute. And they each have a different pose. They're holding something different, but just a lovely little set. Again, I'm not a huge gnome fan, but these seasonal ones are so, so cute. Now here is the clock you saw. Gosh, I wish, I, if you're, 
You know, if you're watching this on the very first day this YouTube goes up, this is on sale right now for something like 56% off. That's if you're catching it today, which I know a lot of you won't be. But if you're catching this on the first day, click on the link, head over to Amazon and get this 56% off. Look, it has glass covering. It, the clock keeps great time. It says Grand Central Station, New York, 1913. It looks really like an antique, but obviously isn't. The back is kind of hollowed. You put your batteries in there. That way it's not quite as heavy. I mean, it's still heavy enough, but it could be a lot heavier. Uh, I love this. It would look fabulous on a mantle. I've always got this displayed somewhere in my house. Um, I've said this before, if you follow me, I'm not huge on antiques, but I always like some something like this in my house. Even if my house was completely modern, um, I would have a few things like this because I feel like, I call them heirloom items. It looks like something you inherited from somebody and it just adds interest to your home decor. So I love stuff like this. I always have a little bit of it kind of, you know, sparkled around my house. But this is a really nice find. Again, if you're watching this, the very first day today that this YouTube goes up, click on it. It's on sale for, I think, like 56% off if you're watching today. All right, next is, oh, this little vase. Sorry, I almost forgot. Isn't that cute? This vase, again, this is something I use all the time. I love this vase. One of my favorites from Sullivan's. It's perfect farmhouse vase. It's slightly distressed. It's really heavy, a nice quality vase. I love that the top of it has got this wide mouth. So anything you put in it will, again, will splay out. I mean, a lot of vases, you know, have a small mouth and then that's gonna look like that, which is fine. But I knew I wanted, you know, a more formal look. So this vase is perfect for that. And then next on the list is these eucalyptus. I love this particular set. There's four pieces to a set. I love them because they're not like real bright orange. You know, it's a soft brownish orange. It's got some brown, orange, gold tones to it. Really pretty. Four pieces to a set. This is two sets, so I have eight pieces in here. The stems, look how long the stems are. So if you had a floor vase, you could easily put these in it and they would work great. All I did was bend it over, pop them in, I'm done. If you have a really short vase, you could also just, you could snip off the stems and put them in there. But I like to bend them that way. They're still, you know, versatile for whatever size vase I want. But I love this combination. Again, I like using my decor items that I normally use every day and just add some fall to them. All right. All right, next on the list, oh, look at this. She's so cute. Pull up the witch on books, honey. I love this. Look at that. I this I think this appeals to, you know, eight-year-old Cheryl because how cute is she? She's a little ceramic witch. She's a shelf sitter, so she will sit on the edge of any cabinet or shelf, you know, any kind of a straight edge. I actually put her right on this little book set, which I will also be showing you. But how adorable is she? And look, look what she's doing. She's got that apple in her hand. And I can't quite tell, is she trying to keep it away from the ghost or is he trying to steal it from her? <laughs> or maybe she's going to share. I can't quite tell, but I love these. And also you will see in the background that big orange pumpkin that is, is coming right up. I will show you that too. Thank you, honey. But here is the witch. She is ceramic, really nice quality, nice attention to detail. You can see, like I said, she is a shelf sitter. So she will sit on, you know, anything with a straight edge. And I think she looks fabulous on these books. These aren't real books. These are pieces of wood painted like books. See, they have, it says uh, bonfires, hay rides, pumpkins on it. And then the front of this one says, hello, fall. And you just, you know, put them anywhere. You could put these, you know, if you're uh, like decorating a tiered tray, by the way, I've got um, tiered tray, fall decor coming up, that's coming up. So if you like that kind of thing, be sure to subscribe because that will be coming very soon and you'll uh, get a notification for that. But look here, look at this combination. I mean, how cute is that? Love this combination, so simple, 
so easy and just adorable. Like if you have little kids in your house, they're gonna love this little witch. So if they're anything like my kids or grandkids, they'll wanna name her. I think she's just adorable. All right. You know, the orange pumpkins, I wanted to show you those also from the photo. Here is the largest in a set. This is a large set of pumpkins. You can click on the link, but there's several. This is the largest. This is the smallest. And they are in a variety of sizes and a variety of shades of orange, which is kind of nice. So you get, you know, you're going to get a lot of different colored pumpkins, all in variety of orange. But I really like this set. Again, foam, cute, indestructible, perfect for decorating. So easy. All right, next, honey, can you pull up the gold pumpkins? If you're looking for, you know, glam decor, there it is. Um, I love all of these. I'm going to start with, let's see, let's start with the trees. Um, let's see the little tree set. That is actually a set of two. They have an on off switch and a timer. Uh, like my big trees that I showed earlier, these are all completely posable. You pull them out of the box and you just start posing those branches however you want, bend them however you want, really easy. They come in a set of two, that will be the first link, but you can just buy a single one. I will also include the link for a single one. The company here is Embrite, E-A-M-B-R-I-T-E. And again, these are 24 inches. So you'll see in the description the 24 inch trees again the set of two or a set of one now let's focus on the gold pumpkins see the large one in the middle that is a sparkly gold pumpkin and uh, i have i'll be showing you a link for that and then on uh, each side of it is a set of sparkly pumpkins and i will also show you that and then the outer edges there are just kind of plain gold pumpkins. So look at those, memorize that scene. All right, now let's look at those close up. All right, here is the set of pumpkins first. Thank you, honey. Hubby over there, he runs my tech. So he's the guy pulling up all of the stuff. So I don't have to, I love that. I mean, you know, I'd be lost without him for a lot of reasons. All right, look at this set. How adorable is this? This is a set of six. These are both by the same company. So remember, this is a set of six. I mean, these are so pretty, you guys. Look at the sparkle on them. They have a crackle finish. I mean, these are so, so pretty. If you want a glam fall, I mean, this is it. Look at these. Now here is the large one. This is all by itself. Just one piece. I will also, obviously the links to all of these will be down below, but look at that. Isn't that just beautiful? So this is the set of six. This is the single one, same company. Now this set, look, these are the ones that are on the outside of the cabinet. These are just kind of your traditional gold color and they come in a set of 12. This is the largest size. I think there might be, three different sizes, three or four different sizes, but a variety of sizes. And this is what they look like. And I personally love the combination of the variety of gold. So these, again, this is the center one. This is a set on one side of the center. This is another, another set of these on the other side. And then these are the gold ones you'll see on the outer edges of the cabinet. I love the look. These are just all so, so pretty. And then the last thing on that picture, can you pull up the gold pumpkins? Again, the mirror. I love this mirror. Uh, again, I did not put it on the wall. I love to just put a mirror on an accent cabinet and then lean it against the wall because that way I can switch it out whenever I want to. No holes in the wall and I still get the same look. So again, I will definitely be linking that one too. Thank you, honey. Thank you guys so much for joining me for fall decor, especially if you join me. I'm putting this up today, August 1st. So again, if it's August 1st, that clock I showed you is on sale right now. But I'm gonna be showing you a lot more fall decor 
in August. So uh, be looking for that. But you guys, seriously, I'm never one to pressure people to buy stuff. I hate that. But if you see something you love, buy it now because it could go out of stock. So as always, thank you guys for joining me so much. I so appreciate the opportunity to help you make your house a home or in this case, maybe to make your house a glam gold pumpkin home or a haunted house, depending on where you're running. But thank you so much for joining me and I will see you next time.